I have to assume that this headlight has to come out to take this washer bottle out, but I already took the bumper cover off and I'll pin that video in the comments or in the description. So the next step to get this headlight out is we have to take these top bolts out. Let's just get the tools and start doing it. So let's get this 10 millimeter out. And let's get this 10 millimeter out. Nope, wrong one. It's right here. Look at this. Someone took this cap off and the cap is actually right down here. There we go. This one back here is actually a T30. To properly get to it, we're gonna have to unclip this right here. See that? That goes down, that pops out. Keep in mind, I'm doing this freehand with one hand and there's a little trigger mechanism right here. All I had to do was push up on that and then pull back on this at the same time. I don't really need to get all of this loose, but it wouldn't be that hard. This was already previously broken, so I didn't do that. But maybe if you wanted to not take a chance on breaking that, then don't pull this back too much. You wanna get this trigger loose, get this trigger loose, and then there's another one on the back there. But I'm assuming if you get like these three loose, there should be enough. All you really have to, you could probably even just snake this out. What I'm gonna do is to get to this 10 millimeter slash T30 right here. And then this one goes all the way down here into these radiator supports. This is a T30. Don't tell Matco Tools, but I just got it loose with my T25 because it was already in my hand. Now we got these bottom bolts. And it looks like this has been off before. Like I said, this thing's probably been in a wreck. So we're gonna get these T25s out. And then that third one right there. By the time you get this third one out, then we have lots of access to this last one. And keep in mind that there probably is witness marks, but it might not be a bad idea to put a little bit of fast drying spray paint on this. And of course you don't want to get it on the lens or anything. Uh, maybe use a paint pen or tell me what you like to use, but it's a good idea to screw it back exactly where you found it. And that one's a little bit too tight to use my T25. I got to grab the proper tool, T30 or 10 millimeter. Now it should be loose, should come straight out. You wanna make sure it's unplugged. Get some plugs in the back. Push in on this and pull back. That, that one's a tough one. You don't really wanna pull on the wires, but I'm working with one hand here. And on something like this, if there's a bunch of big hefty wires, you can pull on it a lot more so than a smaller connector. But don't pull on the wires. Pull this out. Now let's see if this will come loose. Let's move that wire harness. So the first thing I'm gonna try, I don't know what the service manual says, the first thing I'm gonna try is to pull this wire all the way out of the way and just kind of set it on top of here. Be careful with these wires right here. Might wanna unplug that. All right. Now, of course, you also want to have all of this disconnected, all of these wires popped off here. And then I showed earlier how to, I don't know if this is going to be the same video or not, but I showed earlier how to get this off. I've got a few different of these pry bar tools with the U-shape cut out in the middle. Usually you can just wiggle that back and forth. 
and then this one simply pops out and then pops up right like that. Now, let's see if I can wiggle this washer bottle out. hanging up on this AC line right here there we go now what's it hanging up on it's hanging up right here and on this we're gonna go ahead and disconnect this connector right here because that's what it's getting hung up on disconnecting this is no problem give us a little bit more room there we go and looks like we're hanging up on something else right here not a big deal Let's push that down slide it right out so it is possible you just got to take the front bumper off the headlight off and then we can get this whole thing out right like that